with Chief Meteorologist Dennis Phillips for the latest on now Hurricane Elsa. It is, Wendy, although this is the most ridiculous hurricane I think I've ever seen in my entire life. I mean, there's the center right there. It doesn't look anything like a hurricane. Winds, very, very small winds embedded within this system reaching hurricane force. Now, it was not recon that actually determined the speed. Recon is on its way in. It was the weather service in Tampa. It was the Ruskin Doppler radar looking down and picking up winds right around 75 miles an hour. So the folks at the NHC bumped this up from 70 to 75. And then again, magically, it goes from tropical storm to hurricane. I say that because the impacts will not change. This is more of a meteorology thing whether it's a tropical storm or a hurricane at landfall, the impacts are the impacts. And the good news is it's moving pretty quickly at 14 miles an hour. So in doing so, that means it'll be in and out faster, which means there's less of an opportunity for significant flooding rains outside of surge. You know, flooding occurs for two reasons. We have one heavy rainfall, which we will see, but as long as it keeps moving fast, and honestly, I think it's gonna pick up its forward speed down the road, but moving pretty quickly, it won't have nearly the time to dump as much rain as sometimes those hurricanes and tropical systems that can move at two or three miles an hour, sometimes stationary, and you see one, two feet of rain. But when it's moving this quickly, it won't have the time to dump that much rain over our entire area. Sure, we will see flooding because we're soaked as it is. We've had a lot of rain over the last few weeks, but that is a good thing. But at least in terms of the surge, we will continue to keep a look at how things are popping across the area. And at this point in time, you will see that rain. There it is. And there are the storms as it comes in from the south. And at this point in time, Sarasota beginning to pick up the heaviest rain. And that is something that we'll see continuing to spread north. And as Jason said, we're also looking for spin with these as well. So it's now just beginning the worst of this from Sarasota County. It moves into Manatee, Pinellas, and Hillsborough County, as well as Hardy, DeSoto, and Polk over the next hour.